Hello everybody and welcome back to Mega Man X5. I am Rufal, playing this game for you. Woo! We're getting stronger energy reaction. That's intensified, that does the same point, doesn't it? It's too strong! Must be Sigma. Can't be anything but Sigma. Of course he is. Won't stop you from going to fight anymore. You were trying to stop us? Well, whatever. Hooray! We have our hunters. We have ultimate armor. Which we will use. But not the ultimate buster. Make you some speed shots. Ah! We won't be using the ultimate buster because that will actually slow things down considerably in the end game. Also, Zero has his black armor. What's that do for him? Well, not that much, really. It doesn't. It does include, I think, at least two of his. Uh, of the other add-ons just built into it. But whatever. We have stuff to do. And for the, and for the sake of getting things and for the sake of getting the endings in, in proper order or in an acceptable order, we will actually be starting with zero. Then we'll move on to X. So, let's get things underway. Yes! Into the end game! And one of the best music tracks in the game! Woohoo! Nice bit of a drop. Get out of my way. Like that. And you? Next. Just ignore you. Alright, what now? Box! Bees! No! Out of my jerk. Over here, we'll grab a hold of some extra power ups. Because I've noticed, conveniently, uh, these power-ups actually add, add energy to your energy tank, whether you're full health or not. Which is helpful. Maybe that's just a thing for normal. But we've got our Mavericks to deal with. And perhaps one of the worst features of the game. Take a look at that hit point bar. This isn't... This doesn't make him harder, it just makes him take longer. Who in blazes thought this was a good idea? I mean, if you, if you want to incorporate RPG elements into your, into your game, at least do it in a way that makes sense. This is not one of them. It's not like the Maverick Hunters... It's not like X and Zero get gain extra hit points just for the game going on. Outside of collecting heart tanks, that is. Yeah. That way, you. Ah. Problem with the uh, problem with the with the weapon with this guy's with Burton Dino Rex's weakness. This at least Zero's rendition of it is that if you miss, then you're just gonna get hit. You actually can't move Zero for a pretty significant amount of time after you fire the weapon. Why aren't you dead yet? Oh, you're almost there, but get there faster. Thank you.
Yeah, just getting through the Mavericks is going to take a while. Who's next? Dark Dizzy, I believe. There it is. There's the Necrobat. He was one of the bosses slowed down most by actually fighting him with using his weakness. Use whatever will hit him. It's a convenient way to fight. Which is a convenient way to fight most, almost anyone, anything. <laughs> Using what hits. Ah! Let me go. Let go. Jerk. Has to go and use an attack that it's, which would have been made more sense if you had used it when we fought him the first time. Oh well. He had that move back then. He just didn't have enough. He just didn't, he just didn't last long enough to use it. Who's next? Ah, oh, the shining Hotarunicus. or Doctor Izzy Glow. Is he here? Is he there? Hello, sir. That's some lightning. At least, at least some of the Mavericks are, are made faster by using their weakness. But the fact that some of them are actually drawn out and made more complicated by using their weakness it really makes you wonder, is it really their weakness? Especially if you can kill them faster by not using it. I think somebody missed the mark. Now that uh, he's getting faster, we aren't able to stun walk him anymore. Ah! Take that jerk. Now for the guy whose whose entire AI involves moving to moving up to you. Yeah, I guess there's more to his AI than that, but why is that sequence even there? It would make more sense if, if his if his body was like sparking or something. Sheesh. Next. It's the whale. He's, com he's completely broken by his weakness. So at least 
least there's that. But now, yep, he's making his way across. There we go. We don't mind Duff so much. Keep killing those energy tanks. Ah, yes. Now for the Crescent Grizzly. You'll note that the uh, weapon we got from this guy is, the pri is Zero's primary jumping attack. He's immune to it. In fact, we don't really want to use his weakness because it causes this lengthy and vulnerability time. Weakness, of course, came from Max the Red. Or Mr. Rose Red, if you will. Ah. There we go. Aha! Take that, punk! Get out of here! Okay, you want to hit him with his weakness while he's in, while he's buried into the ground or something, but he can't go bouncing away invulnerable. Let's go deal with the pony. Hey, buddy. Aha! Oh! Oh! Ow! Gotcha! How to deal with a flower? It's a rose, man. Set fire to it. Land on him. Glad that we're in three feet if we can help it. Yeah. Which we apparently can. Take like that bump. Come back. You want more? Didn't think so. All right. Uh, 
Let's just straight to Sigma now, right? Not quite. Give me that. Out of the way, punks. And you. Clear off. That's for everyone's favorite Mega Man and Freight. Blocks. These ones are not exactly on a timed pattern. Like the like Mega Man Bolt, like disappearing blocks usually are. They are timed based on when they they enter the screen. Or when their point entered the screen. I'm sure you know what I mean. No reason for that energy pickup. It's time for battle! It's time for conversation! Nice pods. Thunder effects in Zero really found like that. Impressive. You are number one. You're early. <laughs> oh, you're going down. <laughs> huh? Do you want to acquire the power of your true self? I already have it. Old man, that knows a lot about you. It'll be an interesting story. To something greater. Scattered the virus to infiltrate you. You haven't shown signs of waking. <laughs> I'm not going to become a maverick. <laughs> Pitiful virus. <laughs> Power. Quiet, you. I'm not afraid of death. <laughs> I'll take you with me. Yeah, you only think you can compete. Yeah. This is another of those strange riddle points, if you will. Is it? Is it really his weakness if it actually makes the fight take longer? Yeah. That punk. Oh. Seriously? No, wait, let's not be silly. That blast can kill me. Ow. Take that! Ha ha! Victory! Oh great, now what? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Which of you is stronger? X or you? Who cares? Where are you at? Fight me! Boy, that's a big body. I don't want to hear about an old man. It's gross. Oh, 
I don't know him. I don't know him. Quiet, you. Well, like you said, Sigma, Zero's the most powerful in the universe. There we go. You stand no chance. out of this. Time to die. Oh boy. Ow! Clearly that hurt. X, you found zero. Hey, you're unscathed. Looks like Sigma didn't get you. Um, Zero, you okay? Oh dear. Zero, what exactly is your buster going to do? It's been functionally worthless the entire game. Why does it make all the difference to your survival in the end? Uh, I hope X is okay. You should live too, Zero. Good for you, buddy. Because he's there. Why not? Hmm. It's Dr. W. Play dies, they see their origin. Is that the way it works? The one that destroys Reploids. Bye, Zero. Thou art dead. Yep. Take it fast, X. 
Not worth the time it takes. Run for it. That'll do. We'll grab this. We have energy in our tanks. All right. Time to do battle. Start here. Because why not? Hey, Pony. This weapon is useless. Ow. Yeah, uh, maybe cheesing him with the with the ultimate armor, but you know what? At this point, I just want to save time. Come on, buddy. Now you die. We got a lot of Mavericks to beat up. So, no regrets. Next. Since you actually are more quickly beaten using your weakness. Kind of a rarity around here. Take that. There we go. Oh. Stop that dodging. Ah. Sorry, we finished off. This. There we go. We'll try to use. We'll try to show off both the regular form of the weapons and their upgraded form. As much as is convenient to me. After all, there are some bosses where we just don't want to use them. Pressing Grizzly is one of them. But we can show it off anyway. Aha! There, take that. Alright, let's just try and finish him off. Hey you, come over here. Oh. Keep 
more visible. I want to hit you more. There we go. I didn't realize there was standing space on the other side of him. Now for the whale. It was much easier to deal with by using his weakness. Charge, specifically. If it's, if it's too un its aim is too unreliable otherwise. I just love it when a boss has an instant kill in his room. Bother. Ah! Congratulations, it's a squid. Hey, punk. Eat this. Oh, no, you don't. If you want to play your charge game, then we can do that. One problem, my charge is better than yours. Boom, baby. Rather, at least mine looks like an attack. Who's next? Dark Dizzy? No, wait, this is Izzy. Mr. Glow! Color oh, whose weakness we really can't reliably use. Because it involves him landing on us. Zap. <laughs> well, it does look kind of funny when it connects. Alright. Enough of using his weakness. Let's go for speed. Out of here. After Dark Dizzy. His weakness. Theoretically, you can actually kill him in one shot. Trouble is, you have to be willing to spend about a week doing it. A weak fight again. Yeah. The trick is, of course, to catch him with the tail.
But of course, his uh, animation, his stun animation from being hit takes forever. And as awesome as this laser is, it only hits him once. That punk. Oh, no you don't. You need more than bats. Well, that didn't work out so well for you, did it? Die! I'm not quite sure what it was that stunned him there. I guess hitting him while he was charging up was, uh, was, uh, was what got him. Now for the Dino Rex. This one. For which the weapon is, well, kind of lame. Yeah, at least it looks like we go up and punch him in the face. <laughs> it's really the only upside it's got going for it. It's like we're here next to the wall, it hits the wall. Among other things. Like that. Mention, it really doesn't do that much damage. Come on. Get you out of the way. It will Sigma uh, still. Who I really don't plan to abuse the ultimate armor against. I mean, his fight really doesn't take that long. Just have to get to it. Out of the way. Hello, Bork. Weakness, as we've seen, is this one to start. Hello, sir. I got some lightning for you. You know, your traditional weakness. Aha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are you doing all this? <laughs> Fault self. Okay. 
find out what zero truly is. Purify him. Mount was insufficient. Wow. Making it a virus colony. <laughs> you almost annihilated the Earth for that? <laughs> you sick guy. Most of the hunters have also become mavics. Okay, we've had enough of this. <laughs> You're going down. Catch! We get to fight him in very traditional fashion. By hanging up on a- by sitting up on a wall. <laughs> Very reminiscent of the first game. It is definitively by far the safest way to do battle with him. Go figure, right? I risk actually fighting him when we can just tease him. There's your attack that can actually that can actually stop me. Yeah. But do keep in mind that when he uh, that when he teleports back, he goes he goes back to where he was. Whichever side of the room that happened to be. Get back. Why aren't you dead? Go away. Now for round two. Come destroy me then. Quiet, you. Where are you at? Challenge me any time. Uh huh. Okay. Bring quite a few robots. I'm sure we could beat it up even if it was complete. Huh? Used to be a comrade. Okay, now I have no idea who he is. That makes it very helpful. You see, X, there's someone other than me that hates you. Usually you want to jump right away because those fists come come over to say hi. The spike ball is his weakness. Oh. Best way to use it is as shown. Because you can get two hits. Good shot, Noah. 
Oh no, you don't. Take that. You will notice, Hex was kind of close to full health. He looks like he's, he looks like he's crippled. Zero did that too. Or would have if he wasn't actually that injured. Aha! I would die alone! Taking Zero with me! No! Don't use him as a shield! You big jerk. Well, as, I've, as I've, I think I've mentioned before, X actually has two different endings. There's three endings to the game. The endings are based on whether or not Zero was, a, was available in the end game. So, whether or not Zero became awakened or not. We'll see the bad ending first. And then we'll go on to the good ending. Fortunately, the dialogue for this part is exactly the same for both. So we don't have to repeat that. Aha! Now you blow up and go away. Ugh, he went a big. X! No! Hmm? Dr. Light, you've come to save the day! Or have you? Rest and relax for now. Hold on, X. For a few more moments. Forget all the painful memories. One week later, it's time to rebuild. Captain! Don't you remember anything? About what happened? What? You still want about that? No! No, I don't. <laughs> See? Zero and, and X are both special A-level hunters. For all to see. So where's Zero, then? I remember Sigma. No! No memories of Zero! How could it be? Well, right there. <laughs> I don't think it was by mistake. Really? Shut up! We got him back, so who cares, right? <laughs> yep, Cygnus thinks it's a miracle. X came back without a scratch. Yeah. Really? So what do you think happened? You never believe in miracle. <laughs> in miracles. Okay, so really, what do you think happened? Stop evading the question! Hard to say. Maybe by itself? Otherwise it was deleted on purpose. Oh. X has no capacity to remember Zero anymore.
I think this battle will lead to peace. You guys are battling? It looks more like you're constructing. Of course it will. We need to work harder for that peace. What's your private dream, sir? It's a rather personal question. Want to create Elysium. What? <laughs> Paradise where humans coexist with reploids peacefully. Hey, good for you, X. Way to move forward. No, no, we didn't say anything. <laughs> Yay! So apparently, uh, memories of Zero brought X pain. But that's how it could have happened. How about this? Now for what really happened. Zero! Boy, X escaped the, the overall explosion completely unharmed. Zero! Don't leave me, Zero! Oh, golly. Ow. Yeah, the ending is not dependent on if Zero has his bus on if you started with Zero so he's got his buster. It's entirely dependent on if he awakened and by the Eurasia colony being destroyed. X! Your optimism led to your own demise. You should live. X! No! Save him, Deus Ex Machina! Yay! Hold on, X! Notice he didn't tell him to forget all the painful memories or whatever, or whatever. Three years later, well then. Maverick! Wow. Get moving! Let's go! Captain's eyes have changed. They've sharpened. X can face any enemy now. So long as he has Zero's sword, Zero is always with him. Yay! Yay, credits! We've finished! Now, if those endings didn't make sense to you, then it's important to understand that this was supposed to be the final... the... the final game in the series. Planner, Akateru? We don't even know! The series is supposed to end with Zero dying. But I guess, but I guess some of the higher ups at Capcom decided that uh, that doesn't that it doesn't uh, having Zero die doesn't set up for the sequel well enough, and thus we en and thus we have X Six, which I will say is is a game I like a lot better is a game I like a lot better than Five. Chiefly because it does it take it does everything that X X5 did wrong and does it right. 
you know, picking up a part tank as an ink applies to both hunters instead of just one of them. And, this, and though I think the bosses do gain extra hit points in that game, it is at a much slower rate. That and the ranking system in that game is entirely based on a, on a pickup counter. However, having said that, now having played this game, I can, I can now say this is a much better game than what I was remembering. So a lot of my hatred for the title has been unfounded. Mostly because my memories of the game were based that I thought you had to play the game on extreme difficulty to get the, to get the, the true ending. I do know of a number of games that are like that. The primary one that comes to mind is Act Razor 2. Or if you're playing on easy, you can't finish the game. <laughs> but oh well. Actually, it makes me glad to have played to have played this game, so I can see it for the mas for the good game that it is. I'm not sure I'd call it a masterpiece, but oh well. Yeah, really, all this game needed. Need it to be great is a way to skip the dialogue or to just ignore the dialogue. Sound effect, just the one. Tester, just the one. Don't care how many names were there, there's only the one. <laughs> And seriously, how big was Eurasia? Oh well. Big enough to have its own gravity. Maybe that, maybe that was the replacement moon? No, wait, no, we saw the, the moon. It was in the Slash Grizzly stage. Oh well. Yay! Are we there yet? Ah, yes we are. Thank you for paying. Note that playtime. Uh, that does not include any time spent in, in menus or or reading dialogue. You get some absurdly low numbers there. Oh well. This has been Mega Man X5. I am Rufal. I have played this game for you. Hope to, I hope we'll see you next game. Until then, later.